What is going on, Pokemon trainers? This is China Connor, and you're going to be watching my fifth Ultra Sun and Moon Wi-Fi battle video today. Thank you for taking the time to come to this video. Make sure you like this video if you end up liking the match itself. I appreciate the support. This is an OU battle between myself and Sean. We battled before. Um, this is an OU match, of course. And I had a lot of fun in this video. I am trying out Ballistaphon today. Ballistaphon is, of course, the new Ultra Beast in Ultra Sun and Moon. He's a very interesting Pokemon. Um, I wanted to figure out what kind of other mods I wanted to pair up with. I have decided to use Venusaur, Tyranitar, Mega Absol, uh, Skarmory, to name, a, to name a few, if you will. And my opponent is bringing, an, I guess you could say a Sandstorm team, but, like, there's a lot of stuff, our ground types, like Tyranitar, and Gliscor, and Garchomp. This is a Sandstorm team that my opponent put together here. But the main threat is going to be Mega Mawile, because... I did not realize that Mega Mawile got bumped up to OU again. And that is a huge problem. Uh, fortunately, I do have Blissfawn and Mega Absol Fire Blast. So if there is any trouble at all, I do have those options available. So with that said, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get started. Now, I wasn't sure what my opponent was going to begin with. Uh, I had a few ideas, but it wasn't Gliscor off the bat. I began with Skarmory. I wasn't sure what Gliscor wanted to do against Skarmory, so I stay in. I set up my Stealth Dox, but then my opponent sets up his Stealth Dox. That is a little bit sad. I was really sad to see that happen because I had a Mega Absol available. I didn't use him correctly right there, um, but it's okay. The only Pokemon that really doesn't appreciate Stealthos is uh, Ballistaphon. I whirlwind the Gliscor out because I really don't like Gliscor that much. Even though he couldn't do much against me, I just don't want to face him right now. So I whirlwind him out to Tyranitron. I have Steel Wing for super effectiveness and um, this is a little unfortunate because he goes for Crunch. It is neutral, but he gets the defense drop out of it. That means that another crunch is going to finish me off. I really should have switched out right there. I have been a much better play, in my opinion. I just didn't do it right. So, I go into my Manetric. I thought I had the hidden power that is super effective against Tyranitrum. But I do not. And I come real close to KOing that Tyranitrum. That is not looking too bright right now, I know, right? Because, look at that, I've already lost two Pokemon, and we're not even at the middle stage of the match yet. So I go into my Mega Absol at this point, and I'm like, alright, I need to get some momentum back, because my opponent is really just killing me right now. I go for Sucker Punch, which I really should have just gone with a play rough or something, because he could have just shot right there. It's been really risky just going for that sucker punch like that. Now we see my opponent utilizing a Mega Mawile. I didn't realize that it was OU until he showed me at the end of the match. I go with Fire Blast, knowing that he's going to probably KO or come really close to KOing, and I miss. That is a total game changer, because I really don't have anything other than Ballistaphon. I used Ballistaphon right here, but then I realized he probably has Sucker Punch. So I switch out. Going to Trooper, the Venusaur. Venusaur is going to be my go-to Pokemon at this point because without Fire Blast from Mega Absol, how am I supposed to? Because I go Sucker Punch, he's going to easily wipe out Ballistaphon. My best bet is to uh, make him waste his sucker punches. So expecting him to do that right now, I 
discover synthesis, but he uses protect, which I guess that works out okay, because I get my HP back, but I was really crossing my fingers that he would use Sucker Punch and more Sucker Punches and all that so that I can use Bolisophon to take out the Mega Mawile, because if I could get Mawile out of the way, then Vash can resume on a positive note. I switch out, go back into Bolisophon. This is pretty much my only chance of doing it, because I put out the Mawile to sleep and I can use Mind Blown or Fire Blast, but he wakes up on that turn and KOs me. Man, that sucks, because, guys, Marwile is going to come in and just KO things left and right. I don't have anything left at this point, so, yes, you can already tell that I'm going to lose this match just because I, I mean, this is frustrating. Why is this thing you? I gotta wonder. Of course, you do have other Pokemon now that are in OU that have a great uh, amount of like damage to Mawile, but I just I have no words. So the only other way is to put the Mawile to sleep and then use like Giddy Drain and all those attacks. Because I use Earthquake with Chimeratar and that is actually useful because I could probably KO more while with this Giga Drain right here. And guess what? I'm correct. Man, that took a lot to KO just one Pokemon. Because at this point, I only have, I want to say, just Venusaur and one other Pokemon. Oh no, it's actually my last Pokemon. So, man, this is frustrating. So, the only way for me to finish this note finish this match is to um, put everything to sleep and use Sludge Bomb and Giga Drain over and over. I get a critical hit on the reading list right there. That is going to be useful. But is it enough? Probably not. And yes, one Psychic is going to finish me off. So you guessed it. This match is over. All because Mega Absol missed the Fire Blast. If I hit it, the Mawile would have been gone, and I would have had a much better chance of winning the match. But therefore, I, I just didn't do it right. I had bad luck. That's all I had in this entire match. So you guessed it, I lose this match, but I had a lot of fun. But I just have so many questions about Mawile being OU. It's just frustrating. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the match. I should have another match next week. If not, then I'll probably go on show again for a little bit. We'll see. But if you guys enjoyed the match, make sure you like the video and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Alright, goodbye, trainers.